Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Deadly Spark and welcome back to another Ultimate Epic Battle Simulator video. Now today, we have zombies versus military, but a very tiny amount of military on a very tight section of the map against about 40,000 zombies. Can only a thousand soldiers plus a tank hold out? Let's see. The right side zombies will arrive first because they're significantly closer, which means the military will be better equipped to fight them because they get to all fire in one direction. As soon as the other side comes along, it will be split fire and their attack potential will be cut in half. Now, because Now, because uh, of how many units there are and how little there are here and the way they had to be spaced out, the edge of the map is like right here, so I can't fly around as much. I'm surprised as... Oh, no. The zombies are doing a stupid... Oh, this is not... <laughs> Do I... What? Uh, I'm... I'm completely lost for words. I think... I'm going to restart... and reorganize the zombies so that they're not being dumb. Um, I mean, at least these ones are on the path, I guess, if you could even say that. Some of them are sensible. What the f well, this is, yeah, this is just going to be a whitewash by the military because the zombies are uh, what even? How is this? How is this even a thing that they're doing? I'm completely lost for words with the stupidity of the AI. Over a cliff, and the fact that it, they can actually path that direction. Yeah, this this needs to be sorted out because this this completely ruins the whole the whole idea of uh, what. It's getting... It's getting worse the longer the battle goes on. Why are they going up this cliff face? This, sh this should be completely blocked off from their pathing. It's such a... Disappointment. This... Ugh. This would be so cool if we could actually see the battle unfold the way it should unfold. Ugh. Well, we're gonna restart and see if we can't fix this up. Okay, so we're back. We've adjusted where the zombies have started. They're closer, more direct path. Um, same over here, except we've compressed the fuck out of them in hopes that they stay along the path. Um, I just stacked multiple lots together and hoped that they would spawn in. Um, <laughs> fingers crossed this works. If it doesn't, I'm going to try some actual soldiers like Romans, because they seemed to stick on the path the last time we played in this spot. So, if this doesn't work, we're going to try that, and if that doesn't work, that's it. <laughs> so, without further ado, let's begin and see uh, if this works, because I really want this idea to work. 
because it's a really tight space which encourages a different type of battle since only a few zombies can actually line up at once. And so far, it seems good. I'd hate to speak too soon, but it seems like they're following the path. And the right hand side is getting there first. Oh, they're getting overwhelmed way quicker than I thought they would. The tank's not firing? Oh no, it is. It's just the low graphics setting. Oi, yikes. Okay, yeah, this needs some work. I thought this... Damn. <laughs> Bad news. We finally get it working, and then we discover... The zombies are actually, uh... Doing way better than I thought they would. Well, it's an easy fix. I am, I am uh, pleased to report that the AA is not being dumb anymore. And we have a losing battle. <laughs> I was, I was thinking that this would be, uh, they, they'd hold for longer because they have guns, but it seems like they're, uh, they're not like, the, the zombies are actually able to build up. I thought that the, the narrowing, uh, narrowing of the pass would, um, negate most of, um, most of the effectiveness of this number of zombies. Oh, look at that. They're all actually being sensible. Well, I was, I was so concerned for a second that this was just going to be a everything going wrong video. Well. Instead, we've just got miscalculations, which is pretty normal. Um... But I've I've got ways of uh, that I'm thinking of improving this. I wonder if them being weird had something to do with them being at the edge of the map. It was a completely abnormal experience. Why are there soldiers down there? shouldn't be there. I deleted them. They weren't there in the last one. Oh well. The zombies are about to be onto the tank and then that's gonna be it. There's still waves of zombies to go. Okay. Well. Good news for me. I feel like uh, I can, without restriction, increase the amount of soldiers. That'll be fun. But for now, I think this battle is <laughs> more or less over. It's just the Germans holding out in the last line of defense with this glorious Sherman. But I don't think this is going to be a battle that's going to last much longer. And I'm just going to end it before they even go down there. Because they are not meant to be down there. <laughs> Ah, it's just the tank. Yeah, I thought I thought this tank was just gonna. This was just here in case it got this far, and to add that extra flare. Uh, definitely added the extra flare. But I think that's it. <laughs> I love how the zombies slowly tumble down the rock, and then they get if they survive, they get s sent to the. To the rest of the soldiers that are waiting down below. I'm, I'm thinking about maybe adding a second tank and uh, tripling the amount of soldiers in each squad. Um, and seeing the effectiveness that has. Uh, if it gets to the tank, uh, that's probably what I'm going to call it. Because I, I would love for this to actually be an even battle. Because it's just a cool... It's a cool environment to, to hold a battle. Just, uh, like, the, the, it's the last holdout, and they're being flanked from all sides. How much health does this have? This has tons. Why can't I shoot? Well, I'm 
I'm gonna let it do its thing because apparently I can't shoot or move or do anything. <laughs> Incredible. Yeah, the tanks, the tanks holding out on its own very effectively. <laughs> what a scene. I just, I love the, the, what you can do with this game. It's, it's so much better than the first one. The first one, it felt like if I put more than 50,000 soldiers down, it was breaking everything. Like, you needed to have some sort of beefcake of a computer to run even this. Now, that is not the case. I can come in here with as many zombies as I want. Doing whatever I want, I could shoot that time. <laughs> At least get to do something this time. Let me out! Let me out! Let me out! <laughs> Here we go. Well, there you have it. That is that battle, but. Uh, now we're going to try and make it more fun. Less zombies, more soldiers. Let's begin. Did I say less soldiers, more zombies? Less zombies, more soldiers, if I said it the wrong way around before. <laughs> Two tanks, 300 soldiers per squadron. They're now mixing each other. Apparently somewhere up here. That's going to be uh, impossible for the zombies to beat. He's gone from down there. I don't know why he spawned in the first place. Um, and they Look at that. They're falling at a consistent rate, but still getting up in their face. Is exactly what I wanted. Because the more soldiers that go down, the more effective the zombies get. And I'm hoping it stays... Uh, stays like that. See, now that the fire's split... The zombies will be more effective. And they're still, yeah, they're still piling up. Look at that. Against the shotguns, though. Let's see how long they hold out for. They should hold out longer. Uh, because there's more of them. But there's still a lot of zombies. Still an absolute ton. About... How much less? I don't know. 40% uh, less zombies, I think. And I tripled the amount of soldiers. It won't exactly be tripled because some would have disappeared with their spawns, but we still got the two tanks in. And look at this. The zombies are pushing in at a semi-consistent rate. But they're still taking them out at a semi-consistent rate. And this side... Soldiers seem much more effective. It's a different ball game. It's a different ball game entirely. It, it almost feels like I shouldn't have changed the amount of zombies because just that little tweak to the soldiers has made them significantly more effective. Ugh. That's a fucking smear. What a spot to watch. <laughs> Getting absolutely blasted. <laughs> Freaking nasty. They're, uh, ha to me, they're only halfway through the, so the soldiers, which is a shame. How far back do the shotguns go? Assault. Oh. Well. How many zombies have we got left? Still tons or not many? Still tons, nearly. Not even halfway through into this side, though, which is yeah, unfortunate to say the least. Um, I bet some are like firing the other direction too when it when it's applicable. Oh shit! This side's nearly done. The fuck.
It's funny how everything changes, isn't it? What if I just doubled them? Would that make it interesting? Maybe. And this, there's only one way to really find out. <laughs> so if we can find true balance. I don't think we will though. We never seem to find true balance. Look at this, they're all, they're all shifting because they, they've dealt with them on this side. Wow. Didn't even get through the shotguns this time. Fucking wild, eh? The less zombies didn't help, but even with the amount of zombies that, uh, that we had, I don't think it would have made a difference. Because they would have just, it would have just been longer until their victory. <laughs> it's fascinating that they only really get attacked. Like, it's not advantageous for them to be down here shooting because barely any actually died up there. They all died up close here. Whereas here, they've been killing them for a bit. <laughs> oh, look at all that flashing. Not exactly pleasant. To say the least. Well, I think we'll call that here and do one more attempt and see how it turns out. Um, yeah, see you there then. Okay, we're back with our final attempt. We've got 200 of each soldier. We're back down to one tank. We have not adjusted the size of the zombies. Let's see how close this is and. This will be the final battle for sure. No doubt about it. Let's begin. <laughs> I, I'm so glad that the zombies are actually following a sensible path and not being the dumbest zombies that have ever existed by yeeting themselves off a cliff to accomplish absolutely nothing. I mean, these zombies over here are still throwing themselves right in the path. <laughs> way earlier than the other side which definitely proves to be a huge disadvantage um, but the immediate switch that happens as soon as these ones start coming around the corner I'm surprised at the amount that still point up the hill but it means they get closer on this side at least that's for sure oh, look at them pile in absolutely piling in way more than last time. This could get interesting. I'm not sure about the left side. The right side's looking dangerous for the people. And that's, uh, that's given this a more interesting turn. Look at that. They're piling just a hundred soldiers making such a huge, well, I say a hundred soldiers, more like a thousand soldiers overall. But 500 missing from that side is making all the difference. This side, much more, much more slow going for the zombies, that's for sure. But still, they're making progress, a hell of a lot more than last time. Still zombies and zombies and zombies to go. Look at that. Where, how far in are we? Are these the assault troopers or we still got shotguns? Yeah, these are the... We're at the assault troopers now. Absolutely carving through them now. Out of rate of knots. I wonder how much the tank also... The, the missing tank also has to play in this. If that was such a huge asset or not. Because that could have been the difference to one side winning compared to another. Uh, compared to last time, because, I mean, I guess, yeah, they're missing a thousand soldiers and a tank. Which is, uh... Which is a lot. Just, uh, halves the fire rate of explosion. <laughs> Maybe I should have made them shotgunners in the middle. I reckon that could have made things a bit more interesting. They're only at the assault troopers here on this side. Definitely, uh... Definitely much harder for the zombies on this side for sure they can't really build up and it seems like it's because of a choke point here for whatever reason they're really slow and they have to thin themselves out 
Whereas this side doesn't, uh, doesn't have any sort of issues. Look at that, they're half gone though. They're, they're, they're holding out just long enough it seems. And because they're close, obviously the tank's taken an interest in this side. And it seems like they only have pushed halfway so far. So, well, this side's catching up to the, to the destruction of the other side. It's like the closer that they're getting in, the harder it's getting, which is strange but may maybe not as strange as I'm first thinking um, as I was first thinking because they're probably getting caught with stray bullets back here and they're just taking more damage overall than they were and well now they're falling this this could have been one whereas if we, if we had the previous amount of zombies it could have made a significant difference but we've said what if enough times to uh warrant a full TV series about it. Um, <laughs> now, yeah, this is probably as close to balance as we're going to get, because even if they got to here with, like, s stragglers, they're not getting through the big boy. But now now it's just a test of how far into the men they get, in re really. Hey, what? They got it up there. Weird. Yeah, the tank almost doesn't know which way to fire, but yeah, they got halfway on this side. They got further on this side in the end. Wow. That that's a that's a that's something I wasn't expecting at all. This side got further than this side. When this side started way way slower, the layout there there must have been less or something on this side just because of the layout. Fascinating. Oh, this, this is definitely something we can revisit. Maybe with stronger stronger opponents. Maybe like ghosts or werewolves or juices or trolls or orcs. Something, something different that can challenge them. Leave your comments below if you want to see uh, this layout challenged again. Uh, I assume there's a stuck zombie somewhere, but I'm going to count this as a victory. Oh, nope, there they are. There we go. There's a victory for the World War II Army. Well, thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, feel free to hit the like button. If you enjoy this content and want to see more, feel free to feel free to subscribe and leave a comment down below. Uh, but for now, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.